Hello, hi, welcome, welcome back. I don't know what you're doing, but hi. My name is Kenzie, Kenzie May. Um, I love makeup, slightly addicted. Um, I post it mainly over on TikTok, but I've been getting requests for tutorials and I feel like I have more to say than just three minutes. So we're putting it on YouTube. A few weeks ago, by the time this video comes out, it's been more than a few weeks. I did what I would consider my everyday brown, smokyish eye. I did it on my live and everybody asked, where's the tutorial when uh, I was posting the actual videos? And I was like, darn, if only you guys were on my live. So I am sitting down and recording it for YouTube. <laughs> Now to create this look, I started doing this type of eyeshadow when I was like a sophomore or a freshman in high school. It was when Kylie Jenner first came out with her makeup collection and this was the first eyeshadow palette that I was really in love with. Um, as you can tell, the main colors that I used because it hit pan. This is the palette that I used for that look daily. Now, since that palette has come out, there have been quite a few other palettes that have a similar type of color story, but for this purpose, I'm going to be using my James Charles palette. Yes, I covered it in stickers. We don't talk about it. Using the James Charles palette, I... We're gonna fold that all the way over. I typically use this middle row, and it's kind of the same color story as the uh, Kylie Jenner palette. Let's, let's compare. The orange is a little darker on the James Charles palette compared to the Kylie Jenner palette, but essentially the same four colors that I use, including the highlighter, which would make it five, I guess. Well, for this purpose, like I said, I will be using the James Charles palette and let's get right into it. So as per usual, I already have my forehead done. Did not do my contour yet, we'll do it at the end. Anyways, uh, stuck on my pads that I always stick on just to catch any fallout. To start, I will be using a fluffy brush and going into this orangey shade right here. Just putting it all over the crease and towards the outer corner. We're going all out. Now I know this looks insanely intimidating at first, but the way that I look at it, uh, more of a color theory way of looking at it, is orange is just a lighter shade of brown. So I feel like it just helps tie it together. So bear with me, your eye is gonna look orange. Just hold, hold please. Now that orange is all blended in, I will be going in to this darker orange or light brown shade and just put it on my brush and just pack it into my crease. Now with that same fluffy brush, I will be dipping back into the orange and just going over that brown. Just because I want to tone down the orange a little bit, I will be dipping into this peachy nude type color and just going over the top of the orange. Now with that same packing brush, I'm going to be dipping into this darker brown shade and just putting that more on the outer corner of my eye. Like I said, it's gonna look really scary at first. Just bear with me, hang tight, trust the process, and just blend out that dark brown shade. I 
again with the same packing brush just going into black and kind of creating a almost shadow liner now with the brush we were blending with the brown just blending out the black I'm gonna be using this elf glitter eyeshadow in the shade flirty birdie and just putting it on my lid kind of creating a cut crease and just because i like my glitter a little blended i'm going to be blending this outer edge you're feeling like it you could also blend this edge which I'm feeling like doing you don't have to you can just leave it and have it be a cut crease but that's just how I prefer to do it now for eyeliner I'm going to be using the Revlon color stay skinny eyeliner and just doing my regular wing Now that my eyeliner is all done, I'm going to hop off camera, do my base, and I will be back to finish the eyeliner and the uh, eyelashes. I did my contour, my blush, my base, all that lovely stuff. Have lip <laughs> my lipstick, chapstick on. Now we're gonna go straight in to eyeliner while watering the waterline. This is the Wet n Wild eye pencil in black it's been used so much doesn't have a label on it anymore now that my water lines are lined i'm going to be taking a pencil brush and just smoking out the bottom lash line Now my lower lash line is smoked out, I'm going to be using the Benefit Roller Lash Mascara and coating my eyelashes in some mascara. For my eyelashes, I will be using the Ardell Naked Lashes in the shape, I believe that this is 420, not 421. And just using my duo lash glue to properly coat the lash line. Now that I have my eyelashes on, I'm going to highlight. I'm first going to set my face with the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. And while that is still wet, I'm going to be using the Revolution Highlighter Reloaded in the shade Dare to Divulge and just highlighting my cheekbones. And my nose. And my cupid's bow. With a bigger packing brush, I'm going to, again, be dipping into the highlighter, just highlighting my eyebrows. Also putting it on the inner corners of my eye just to brighten them up. And my comfy everyday lip duo that I always use is my MAC Lip Pencil in Soar and my NYX Lip Lingerie Lipstick. Yeah, liquid lipstick in the shade Strip Down. And I will just quickly zoom through that and then we will go to the outro. Now 
now that my lippy is all done, my whole face is done, this is typically what I would use for an everyday kind of look. It might be a little much for some people, but I really like this a lot. And it was also highly requested, especially after I did it on my live, and it was posted the next day. Any hoosies. I hope that you guys found this tutorial in the slightest bit helpful. If you have not already, go hop on over to my TikTok. I currently have 21,600 of you guys over there. That's a lot. <laughs> also, I have an Instagram and Snapchat. Instagram is now at a little over, I think it's 120 something. Um, so that's exciting. All of my socials are lil underscore baby 511. That's L I L underscore BBY 511. And that's my spiel. If you guys haven't already, feel free to subscribe. Sound off down below if you are going to try this look. I would love to see you guys tag me in it. I love seeing you guys recreate my stuff. It makes me so happy. Anyways, I hope that you guys have a great night, day, week, weekend. Whatever you're doing, have a great time doing it. <laughs> and I will see you guys next time. Also, before I forget, I am trying to keep a regular posting schedule here on YouTube. So I will be posting every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. If I do miss Wednesday, I promise there will be a video on Friday. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys so much for being here. Have a great whatever time it is, whether it's 3 a.m. I don't know. Bye!